yet another asymmetric epoxide. So if we look at the two uh, carbons for our epoxide, this carbon is tertiary, this is secondary, and we're treating it under acid catalyzed conditions. And so we're going to go for the more substituted carbon. And again, we'll just copy this guy. Get a little copy paste action here. Copy and paste. And so for this case, we're going to substitute at this carbon. So in order to make room for this guy, let's get rid of our leaving group. The epoxide is a leaving group. It's just tethered to the other carbon. That's all right. You can just hang out there. And where it used to be, we now have a methoxy group. And cement this guy, and that is just fine. And this is consistent with the idea under acid catalyzed conditions. We get substitution at the more substituted carbon of the epoxide.